Places of worship will once again be empty this weekend, which means another Sunday without the offering plates being passed. News 8's Donovan Long is finding out the impact coronavirus is having on West Michigan churches. Salvation is free, but ministry is very expensive. It's a calling Pastor Jathan Austin says comes with a price tag. It's expensive to still provide those resources to make ourselves available. Although there isn't a soul in sight, the spirit of giving lingers. The Davis family tithes from their dinner table, virtually supporting Pastor Austin. I feel the glory of God. And Bethel Empowerment Church. My family and I make it a priority to still give. As members continue worshiping from home. This is powerful though. They tithe online through an app or mail checks to the church. The money keeps Bethel afloat during the uncertainty of the coronavirus pandemic. Our giving actually went up during this pandemic time. It went down for No Greater Love Ministries. The people are not here, so when the people are not here, some of them just don't give like they normally give. Pastor Willie Weaver says some are holding back because their finances have taken a hit, but bills keep coming. He says it's now challenging to keep the church's lights on. I believe God's going to work it out. God's going to work it out. What lies ahead for worship leaders remains a mystery, but what's clear, this crisis too shall pass. Regardless of how AIDS Church may be affected by the COVID-19 outbreak, worshipers tell me they'll continue operating in faith, not fear. Reporting in Grand Rapids, Donovan Long, News 8.